What's cracking, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. And today, I was uh, I was on the Twitter this morning. I have to uninstall social media from from my phone, by the way, like every every Saturday, and I install it again on Fridays. So I jump on there, and the first tweet that I see made me LOL. Tom McDonald goes, "Lots of people seem to be really mad that I'm dropping a song with Ben Shapiro on Friday. What the freak is this gonna be?" He says, "To those I've ups who I've upset, I just like to say." There isn't a metric small enough to measure how little I care. Of course, soften the blow with the, with the heart emoji. To the folks who are excited, two sleeps till Friday. I'm gonna start using that 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 term. There isn't a metric small enough to measure how little I care. That's 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 brilliant. And boom, he comes and says a song called Facts. Tom McDonald, Ben Shapiro. Like is Ben Shapiro rapping? We pulled it up. Wow, does dude look weird in a hoodie? But great merch. Facts don't care about your feelings. I don't care if I offend you. I work for a tank company. Uh, hopefully nobody in the company I work for watches this video because love me the merch. So let's roll it. Thank you guys if you clicked on this video. Let's let's see. Like, no idea what to expect here, bro. They call me offensive, controversial. It's only two okay. boys and girls. They can't cancel my message because I'm the biggest independent rapper in the whole freaking world. Claim that I'm racist, yeah, all right. I'm not ashamed because I'm white. If every Caucasian's a bigot, I guess every Muslim's a terrorist. Every liberal is right. I don't want to talk. <laughs> oh, 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 dude. <laughs> Oh no, this isn't gonna go well in my job, but who the freak cares? All right, so we're going hard with the rap. I've listened to Ben Shapiro in an interview with Zuby, and they were debating whether rap was even music, so props to Ben Shapiro, I guess, for, for doing this. I'm white. If every Caucasian's a bigot, I guess oh, every that's... Muslim's a terrorist. Every liberal is right. I don't want to talk so to folks good, who don't dude. get it. Go woke, go broke, no hope is pathetic. Pro choice, pronouns, pro love, you're progressive. But you ain't pro gun, no one to protect it. Where the American flag said, remember when people would hang those? They've been taken down, they all been replaced with BLM flags or a rainbow. This ain't rap, this ain't money, cars and clothes. We ain't selling drugs, we ain't gonna overdose. We ain't pushing guns, ain't promoting stripper poles. We won't turn your sons into thugs or your daughters into I don't care if I offend you. It's so weird seeing him, bro. What is this gonna be? You can cry and you can scream. You can ride in the streets. You defunded the police. Now there's no one to protect you. I hope I offend you. I ask myself what would Ben do? Nice. What would Ben do? Let's just keep it real, facts. Don't care how you feel, man. If you want my pronouns, I'm the man. I'm the man who don't respect. Let's look at the stats. I've got the facts. My money like Lizzo. My pockets are fat. Homie, I'm epic. Don't be no a No effing way. I am so happy right now for some reason. Because homie reminds me of like me and my friends liked to befriend the nerdy kids in school and try to dress them all cool and whatnot. He's taking me back, dude. Okay, okay here he goes. Man. If you want my pronouns, I'm the man. Such a good line, dude. Stats. I've got the facts. My money like Lizzo. My pockets are fat. Homie, I'm epic. Don't be a whap. Dog, it's a yarmulke. Homie, no cap. Look at the graphs. Look at my charts. You're blowing money on strippers and cars. You go into prison. I'm on television. Dogs, no one knows who you are. Keep hating on me on okay. the internet. My comment section all woke Karen's. And I make racks off compound interest. Y'all live with your parents. Nikki takes some notes. I just did this for fun. That was good, all my bro. People download this. Let's get a billboard number one. This ain't rap. This ain't money. Cars. Lyrically, that was actually pretty good, dude. I like that. I'm trying to find, did he write his verse? Lyrically clever. I think with how high his voice is, a good call on just talking through in the lower register. And the sound of it could have been much much worse, but for what the song's about, I, uh, you know, that's what you want, I guess. I underestimate, by the way, how good of a rapper Tom McDonald is, though. All my people download this. Let's get a billboard number one. This ain't rap, this ain't money, cars and clothes. We ain't selling drugs, we ain't gonna overdose. We ain't yeah. pushing guns, ain't promoting stripper poles. We won't turn your sons into thugs or your daughters into hoes. I don't bro. care if I offend you. I was put into a set of you. <laughs> you can cry and you can scream. You can ride in the streets. You defunded the police. Now there's no one to protect you. I hope I offend you. I ask myself what would Ben do. Let's just keep it real. I like Tom McDonald, dude. If like you want my pronouns, I'm the man. I'm the man who don't respect you. You mad, you mad. Nice. You blame everybody else for every problem that you can. 
You said, you said, you said. I will never say I'm sorry. I ain't taking nothing back. Let's go, dude. I don't care if I offend you. Yes. I was put here to upset you. You can cry and you can scream. You can ride in the street. We got really like two verses. Typical, typical rap song formula, which is fine. Yeah, yeah. Video by Nova Rockefeller. Yeah. All right. So look, it's a good song. Spencer Peer, the best rapper ever. No, but this song's gonna be everywhere on the internet. So for the purpose, for its purposes, I don't like flawless, right? And that's how you market something. That's again, this was posted on YouTube 27 minutes ago. It has 43 million, uh, 43,000 views. Let's just do a quick refresh. I don't want to listen to it again. Yeah, 43,000 views in 28 minutes on YouTube alone. Um, yeah, man. And the thing is, like, I liked the message, bro, because I'm 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 like now on the side of people who I'm just like kind of tired of. I'm tired of like the the biggest currency in the world to be you're being offended or being a victim. I, I I've I've gotten tired of that. And so there's something cathartic to the song, right? Because you know, it, it it expresses some things that you may feel and uh, expresses things that you wish you could say to some people, right? And especially this, it hits a little closer now because I have a, a statue of Jesus on my desk at work. Uh, the past 14 months at work have been the hardest, uh, the hardest time of my life. And so I put the Jesus statue on there to feel better. And yeah, I've had people try to get me in trouble for having it. So because of that, songs like this uh, resonate more. So I, so I like it. I mentioned earlier though, that I am turning off social media off, uh, you know, just completely off of my phone and whatnot, mainly because I learned that everyone like that I know and like talk to in real life, none of them actually like use Twitter and things or, or listen to that, like political, you know, like YouTubers and whatnot. And so I've learned that, you know, for me, I just want to avoid all of this as much as possible, actually, no matter what side it's from. I'm flawed enough and got enough crap to to get in order my own life to just get mad about something else. But coming and visiting, you know, the world today. Yeah, bro. I like that song. <laughs> like it. Facts don't care about your feelings. Very true words. Sadly enough, and because all, all of us are, are people and have, you know, our, our feelings are such a big thing. Oh, by the way, I just noticed. Um, Tom McDonald's sweater, he just, he put that logo on a Fabletics sweater. That's a good idea. I love, I love me some Fabletics. Their stuff's comfortable, dude. But was that, what I was saying is it's sad that like as people, our feelings also don't care about the facts, right? We're typically led by our, our, our feelings and emotions instead of using logic to, to question them. We, we think our emotions are the truth when they're just our ego's reaction based on our previous experiences in life, right? So we're blinded to facts. And also, sadly enough, I don't think facts can cool down the emotion. So it's like an unwinnable battle, to be honest, in my opinion. Call me offensive, controversial. There's only two genders, boys and girls, man. Claim that I'm racist. Yeah, I'm not ashamed because I'm white. I mean, preach because my daughters are half white. I don't want them to feel any any shame about their mom, who's the freaking best person in the world. I don't care if I offend you. I was put here to upset you. You can cry and you can scream. You can riot in the streets. You defunded the police. Now there's no one to protect you. I hope I offend you. I ask myself, what would Ben do? That's clever. I just keep it real facts don't care how you feel mad if you want my pronouns i'm the man i'm the man who don't respect you <laughs> jeez sorry dude it's funny i'm saying sorry by the way to the co-worker in my company who's getting pissed that i like this right now let's read uh, ben shapiro's verse again i i think the song came out too early to find out whether or not he wrote uh the the verse or not let's look at the stats i've got the facts my money like lizzo my pockets <laughs> Bless her heart. Homie, didn't think I'd hear Ben Shapiro say, homie, I'm epic. Don't be a wop. That song's nasty. Dog, it's a yarmulke. Homie, no cap. I actually still don't understand what no cap means. Look at the graphs. Look at my charts. You're blowing my money on strippers and cars. You're going to prison. I'm on television. Dog, no one knows who you are. Reminds me of one of my first visits to America when I was in when I was 14, year, 14 years old. I said, que onda perro to somebody. And they were like, dude, did you just say what's up, dog? I'm like, yeah, so you, that's what you guys say, right? Keep hating on me on the internet. My comment section's all woke Karens. 
Yeah. Now we make racks off compound interests. Y'all live with your parents. <laughs> Nikki, Nikki Minaj. Nikki, take some notes. I just did this for fun. I don't I actually don't get the reference. All my people download this. Let's get a billboard number one. Cool. If we wrote him cool, if Tom run for him and he wrapped it, doesn't matter. But we'll we'll find out. Um, yeah, let's let's close this video out, man. Um, all I'm gonna say is with all of this stuff going on in society and whatnot, I'm I'm gonna keep it real with you. With you, I've never said with you in my life. I think it's because I just listened to a, a a rap song. I'm gonna keep it real with you. I don't have that much like hope for the future, to be honest at a grand scale, right? But I actually, it actually doesn't matter. I have hope for my family. And I know that we'll be okay and we'll be together and we'll we'll confront anything we have to confront together. And that's where my focus is. Cause yeah, this division, I don't know. I, I don't know where it's gonna go. Like I already know that there's people who are gonna be pissed off in, in the comment section for this video that I like this, right? Like you'd be like, how did you like that uh, Zionists uh, verse and whatnot? Like I know it's gonna happen. So again, um, I, 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 I don't care. Song was good, entertaining, well-produced, great music video. I had fun. Sue me.